Hello, my name is Grant Kramer, and I am a professor emeritus at the University of Nevada, Reno. Today, we'll be continuing my series on grapevine varietals. Are you passionate about wine as I am? Then you know that growing grapes, fermenting wine, and drinking that wine is good for the heart as well as the soul. And if you are interested in having some private consulting or direct contact with me, you can reach me at my new email address called drvinoinreno at gmail.com. I'll be happy to respond to you. Today, we will be talking about Gagliopo, an Italian varietal that originated someplace in southern Italy, perhaps in Calabria, where there are writings that are referring it back to 1240 AD. We now know from genetic evidence that the parents of Gagliopo are Sangiovese and Montonico Bianco, which is a white grape, both of which come from southern Italy as well, increasing the evidence that it comes from this region. Some synonyms for Gagliopo are Alianico di Cassano. You shouldn't interpret that as being the same as Alianico, which is a different variety. Arvina Nero, Sirotana, Galopo, Galopolo, Moralino Pizzuto, which has been clearly identified by DNA as exactly the same as Gagliopolo, Navarna and Uva Navarna are just a few of a number of synonyms for this grape variety. The only really popular location for Gagliopo is Calabria, which is the main red wine grape grown in this region. Because of that, you can tell from being in southern Italy that it likes warm to hot climates. And we can see on my chart down here on the left that it is a mid to late ripening cultivar. The growth characteristics of Gagliopo are that it is a vigorous vine. It has medium sized leaves that have anywhere between three to five lobes. If you look at these two leaves on the right, you'll see that they look a little bit different from each other, but they're produced by the same author. I presume that there is some variation in the grape leaf morphology as we commonly see in other grape varieties. It has moderate to deep lateral sinuses and an uneven moderate toothed margins and it has a U-shaped petiolar sinus. The clusters are medium to large, elongated and conical and can have up to two wings on each cluster. Sometimes there are no wings, sometimes there's only one wing. It has a short, thick peduncle, which is the stem that attaches to the cluster. And it has pinkish to black berries. And black is referred to really as a red grape, but it produces such a dark colored skin, it looks black. And they are medium in size and ovoid. It is a very productive variety. It's known to be both frost and drought resistant. It has, as I mentioned, a mid bud break and a mid to late season harvest time. It's commonly grown in clay soils in Calabria. It is susceptible to mildews and it is usually trained or pruned to a short training style. Here's a picture of a vineyard of the Brandi winery in Calabria, Italy. Gagliopo has a lower than normal anthocyanin content, and those anthocyanins are considered somewhat unstable in the wine, which means that they can drop out a little bit. So its anthocyanin to tannin ratio is lower than many red varieties. It therefore produces a medium color, and again, color is in part dependent upon the amount of extraction on the skins. The longer you can get an extraction, the more color or tannins you can get out of the wine. But So this is dependent in part on the winemaker. But this variety has different characteristics to other red varieties. It has a moderate acidity, and it 
has a range of wine styles going from rosé, which is very light in color, to full-bodied, but soft reds. The fruit flavor descriptions are red and dark fruit, rose aromas, minerals, some herbaceousness or underbrush characteristics, some spice and or licorice. To my surprise, there are no registered clones or selections in California. In fact, in searching for whether Gagliopo is grown in the United States, I could not find any references to Gagliopo in the United States. It appears to be largely, if not exclusively, grown in southern Italy. So in summary, Gagliopo is an ancient variety from southern Italy. It is the most widely used red wine variety in Calabria today. It is a mid to late ripening variety, does well in warm to hot climates, and is drought resistant. It therefore is a good candidate for southern Nevada. However, to my knowledge, as I said, this grape variety is not available in the USA. But perhaps upon some requests, these can be imported and brought to the foundation plant services in California, where in the future, this variety could be grown here in the United States. Well, that's it. If you like this video, then please like it on my YouTube channel. And if you're interested in more videos like this one or on viticulture or enology, then I encourage you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a great day.